Hello students, hello world, math geniuses. Dr. K here in Florida poolside. Okay, no, come on, let's focus on some math, okay? Visiting my mother here down in Florida, just thinking about math, always have a notebook with me. I was just thinking, if we have three consecutive numbers, okay, three consecutive numbers, let's say three and four and five, three consecutive integers, we multiply them together. You know, if you think about it, all you have to do, you take the middle number, you cube it, and then you subtract the middle number again. You don't believe me? Do the math. Three times four times five, that is equal to 60. And that's the same thing as four to the third power. Four times four times four, that is 64 minus four. It works. It works with any, any, any three consecutive integers. Now, why is that? Why is that, Dr. K? Prove it, prove it, prove it. N minus one multiplied by n multiplied by n plus one that if you do the math this is really nothing more than n times n squared minus one and if you distribute the n into here it's n cubed minus n and that's what it comes from okay you want to do another example yeah let's do another example let's say um five times six times seven. Oh, what do we do here well the middle number is six. If I take the middle number, I cube it. I subtract the middle number again. I say that those are gonna be equivalent. You don't believe me? Let's try. Five times six is what? 30, did you say 30? You better say 30, 30. 30 times seven, 210. What about now? Six times six times six, that's 216 minus six, 210. Again, 210, 210. And it's all just beautiful math. My job is to make you a math genius. I don't care where you are in the world. I don't care if you're visiting your mother in Florida. I don't care if you're wherever you are. Think about math 24 seven. And my job is to make you a math genius. And enjoy, proud of you.